Hello, I want to make a quick video how to create uh, this waveform on oscilloscope in, in, uh, by using STM32 F, F4 uh, high performance um, ARM Cortex M4 uh, processor. So, first, what you have to do, we have to create a, a picture in X, XY mode. So, let's take with this YouTube. Uh, uh, we create simple fonts and we, at each corner we add a point that will be represented in, in, the, uh, in the table, in the lookup table. Of course, we only have to add points to uh, corners and we, don't, we, we, and we can't extract these points by software. So what I did is simple average. Um, let's focus. So I take uh, I take array, uh, add it to new array, and when I uh, find the middle point and add it to uh, again into array, and I repeat it for uh, all my lookup table, and I and I get double the resolution. Uh, next thing to do is to so this is how my lookup table look like. When I create a very large array that you cannot do with Arduino, this is this is huge. Um, uh, inside uh, inside processor memory, of course. So what I create is a lookup table for sinus, of course, because it's very slow. I I can calculate it, it real time. And when I do, I shift my array because I have 12 bits, so I shift it by uh, 11 bits. When I multiply by uh, one period of sinus, this this its cycle will will clock out one period, and when I uh, add again eleven bits. So what I'm going to do is I will create a waveform like this. This point is the middle. Then shift it uh, to here. When I multiply it, it will uh, it will shrink. Uh, uh, by the phase of uh, sinus, and then I will shift it to the uh, to the center. So all I'll get is, is something like that, pulsing, pulsing the. And after that, uh, the only thing to do is because I have uh, sinus it has uh, full period, it will eventually uh, uh, switch um, quarters. So I will, I will have e on this side. And when I on, go on this side, and again on this side. It's very simple. And so now, uh, first thing to do is to test your code. So I created the simple, uh, simple uh, lookup table in Excel. Uh, and what I have to do is paint it in the uh, in simple plot line. And this is how it should look like. Now, uh, one thing to note: you want you you, you want to paint like this, ding, 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 and uh, you don't want to jump from like from here to here. You want short, uh, very short lines in between the points. And of course, I could uh, I could do a better job, but that's just for testing. And well, it works. Of course. I don't like uh, XY mode on this oscilloscope. It's very, very, I don't know, something's wrong with it. Uh, analog scope would look much better. Uh, maybe I will try with analog scope. And this is this is my STM development kit. And, uh, and to print it, the DAC is simple. I initialized uh, two, uh, two channels. And of course, I don't need the DMA. All I need is, uh, is uh, GPIO, uh, port clock, and that port. Uh, to the, when um, triggers uh, is, I don't have any trigger, and I enable DAC. And I simply uh, send, uh, uh, send my data at the same time to two channels, uh, it's, and it's uh, right aligned. So that's it. Thank you for watching this.